Without objection, the gentleman is recognized for one minute. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Uh, last night I spoke with a woman in Madison, a federal employee who works as an air traffic controller and helps ensure the safety of thousands every day. And she asked me why should she be working when she doesn't even know if or when she'll get paid. And I didn't have a reasonable answer for her. I received a letter from a woman in Baraboo who relies on federal contracts to run her small business. She asked me how she's going to be able to make payroll this month if the government doesn't pay its bills. And I didn't have a reasonable answer for her. I don't have a reasonable answer for why the Wisconsin National Guard can't conduct its trainings, why local small businesses can't grow their business and have loans to the Small Business Administration, and why 113,000 infants, children, and pregnant women can't receive nutrition assistance from the WIC program. Mr. Speaker, it's time the GOP House leadership starts acting like responsible representatives. Let's reopen government, let's prevent our country from defaulting, and then let's sit down and negotiate our budget as Democrats have been requesting for the last six months. It's time to do our jobs. Gentlemen's time has expired.